What to do if being blackmailed on WhatsApp? Hey there, imagine this. You're enjoying your day when suddenly a message pops up on WhatsApp. It's someone threatening to share your private information unless you pay up. Your heart races, panic sets in, but hold on, take a deep breath. You're not alone and there's a way out. If you've been targeted by sextortion or blackmail on any social media, our channel is here to support you. Featuring over 50 hours of content, we offer insights on prevention and effective strategies for resolution. Whether you're seeking proactive measures or assistance in handling the situation, our DIY videos provide practical guidance to combat sextortion and online blackmail. How do blackmailers operate on WhatsApp? First things first, let's talk about how blackmailers operate on WhatsApp. They might lure you into a false sense of security, trick you into sharing personal or compromising information, and then they strike. It's a manipulation game, but one you can always win by staying calm and knowing the right steps to take. Steps to protect your account. Expanding on the initial steps to protect your WhatsApp account, here are additional measures you can take to enhance your security and privacy. Enable two-step verification. This crucial feature adds an extra layer of security by asking for a PIN when you register your phone number with WhatsApp again. It's a simple yet effective way to prevent unauthorized access to your account. Be cautious with who you share with. Limit sharing personal information such as your phone number or private messages with unknown or untrusted individuals. Regularly update WhatsApp. Ensure that you have the latest version of WhatsApp installed on your device. Updates often include security patches that protect against the latest threat. Lock your WhatsApp with a PIN or biometric security. Use the built-in app lock feature or third-party apps to add a PIN pattern or biometric lock specifically for accessing WhatsApp, providing an additional security layer. Review privacy settings. Go to WhatsApp settings, account, privacy and review your settings. Consider setting your last seen profile photo, about and status to my contacts or nobody to limit who can see your information. Disable cloud backups or encrypt them. Be aware that backups to iCloud or Google Drive may not be protected by WhatsApp end-to-end -end encryption. Consider disabling cloud backups or using an encrypted backup service. Activate security notifications. Turn on security notifications to be alerted if WhatsApp encryption keys change for any of your contacts. This could indicate potential security risks. Be aware of suspicious links and scam. Do not click on unsolicited or suspicious links sent via WhatsApp messages, even if they appear to come from contacts you trust. Scammers often use compromised accounts to spread malware or phishing attempts. Use WhatsApp View Once feature for sensitive photos and videos. For sharing sensitive media, use the View Once feature, which allows recipients to view photos or videos once before they disappear. Educate yourself and others. Stay informed about the latest security threats and share this knowledge with friends and family members who use WhatsApp. Educating others is a key step in creating a safer online environment for everyone. How to stop the crime on WhatsApp. Report blackmail on WhatsApp. Open the chat, tap more options, then report. This alerts WhatsApp to the malicious activity. Contact authorities. Blackmail is a crime. Reporting it to your local police is crucial. Document everything. Keep records of all communications, screenshots, messages, everything. You'll need this as evidence. How can digital investigation help? This is where digital investigation shines. With our adept analysts who specialize in IP address services, employ social engineering tactics, and collaborate with payment portals like Western Union and MoneyGram, we navigate through the murky waters of anonymity and extradition laws that protect these criminals. We don't just investigate, we provide a comprehensive report with all the evidence gathered, giving you and law enforcement the upper hand. If you find yourself thinking, I am being blackmailed on WhatsApp, remember you're not powerless. Digital Investigation is here to help. Our expertise in handling cases of blackmail on WhatsApp makes them your best ally in these trying times. Don't hesitate, give Digital Investigation a call. Our helpline is your beacon of hope. Conclusion. Remember, if you're being blackmailed on WhatsApp, 
knowledge, and the right support are your best defenses. Set your account to private as well as report the message or profile where the messages come from. And if you ever find yourself pondering, what do I do if someone blackmails me? Remember to call Digital Investigation at 800 790 4524 or visit www.digitalinvestigation.com. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and follow for more content that empowers and protects you and your loved ones online. By subscribing and following us, you'll have access to the latest news, tips, and advice on how to protect yourself and your loved ones from cybercrime, online scams, and other dangers.